Hey Toy Fans, it's Roberto here doing another unboxing and this time it is from AEW's um, Unrivaled Collection from Jazzawares and this is Andrade El Idolo, um, one of uh, the, uh, the biggest stars that come out of Mexico in the last couple of years that signed with uh, NXT and WWE for a while and then uh, migrated to um, AEW and um, He's a great wrestler. I like that he's uh, his look. He's got like a, basically the black mask from uh, DC Comics, um, and yeah, I like the suit. Um, I like his his fashion. It was a los uh, was it a, a, a Lij? Well, that's the Japanese version. Whereas they're like the ungovernables, but um, pretty cool. It's AEW on the side and. There's a picture of him on the back. The other figures in the wave. It's a pretty good wave. Um, no, uh, no information here other than it says this is Dynamite in Miami, Florida. He's there for Vicky Guerrero, which was uh, that's pretty fun. Um, I wonder. Uh, well, yeah, I don't. I don't know why they took Vicky away from him. To be honest, uh, it's a. Uh, <laughs> I love Vicky. She's a she's an annoying net mouthpiece for sure, but that's uh, that's the point. Um, and uh, but yeah, and he's got uh, a manservant, so he's doing like the uh, just the the rich, uh, basically um, upper crust of uh, <laughs> like uh, and uh, what do you call it? Just I don't know. My my brain isn't working at all. But he's um, like he doesn't really lean into the gangster uh, aspect of it, even though he's got the look. Um, he's 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 just a rich guy that wants what he wants. Um, so <clears throat> definitely cool though. And nothing nothing's really been explained as to why he wears the black mask, other than you know he's he's a luchador, so. And he can wear a mask whenever he wants, but still, um, pretty cool. But yeah, he's got like uh, basically a gimp mask or just something, and it's it's a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool look. I um, I wasn't gonna skip on that one since uh, I don't know how long he'll be in a in AEW because I don't think he's very happy. But anyways, that is a a, a very Thick feeling piece of plastic there, but no, uh, he's got like a the soft. Uh, well, it's a, a soft plastic, but it's not. Um, it's not soft goods suit. Um, looks good though. Does it open? Oh, it does. That's cool. So it's got it's got buttons there. Um, the mask. You can see, you can see his eyes through uh, the front. He's got his a hanky, black gloves. And then he does the whole, uh, he does the whole unrobing gimmick during, the, or undressing during the, um, his entrance, basically. And, oh, lost his head real quick. Let's see if I can, then, let's see if we can get this, uh, head off. Um comes with the black gloves come off here and then let's see first we just swap out the uh, the head seems like it popped on and that's a uh, definitely a great uh, rendition of his head it's even got his hair tied back um, it's got a pretty sweet beard going like uh just just boss looking character right um now for the jacket this is one of those things where i don't know if i even should take it off because it's gonna be impossible to just oh there it goes okay oh that was a nice little surprise too looks like he's got some wristbands and Came with a couple of hands. See if I can get these out without knocking my shelf over again. 
it. Just a sick way to. Gosh, they really. Uh, really uh, worked it in there. Okay. I cut the packaging to even have a shot of getting it out. But, anyways. It comes for when he takes off his gloves. His actual rustling hands. And just a, a great uh, great looking figure. Now, that's a that's a tough one because this is a this is a very nice head sculpt. Um, I'm always partial to uh, cool mass though, so it's gonna be definitely an interesting one. Oh, that's so cool! Like even on the uh, even on the back of the mask, you can see his hair like tucked in. So let's pop this off. Oh, oh well. Maybe next time. This this figure is just dying to escape my hands apparently, but um, it's got it's got a pretty good um, articulation for a wrestling figure. You'll be able to do all the moves you want. It look, I'm fairly confident. Um, double jointed elbows, double jointed knees. Is it double jointed? Oh yeah, it's kind of hidden. Definitely he's got double jointed knees, but yeah, you can do uh, all of his, his luchador style. Um, great character. I, I really uh, I really enjoy his work, uh, his look, um, and hope he gets some better uh, a better storyline and opponents in AEW before he before he leaves because uh, he's definitely an asset and they they should use him a little bit better I think. But regardless, um, like subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know if you. Got this Andrade El Idolo or um, or not? And uh, talk to you next time. Thanks a lot. Bye.